Our teaching is called the science of mind and spirit, sometimes shortened to be simply the science of mind. And the movement that we are a part of is the Centers for Spiritual Living. Now, we used to be a part of what was called religious science, but that created too much confusion. So I want to clarify right now what we're not. Uh, we are not Christian science. Uh, we are not Scientology, although there's nothing wrong with those, but we are not that. Uh, nor are we traditional religion, or religion in the traditional sense. Uh, in, in, instead, what we really are is, is a response to a deep spiritual yearning. Now, I know that a lot of folks call us a cult, but we're not a cult, because one of the trademarks of cults is trying to control people and, and program, them in, program them into what to think. And we don't try to tell you what to think, we teach you how to think. And we don't want to control your life, we want to free your life. Besides, you people are uncontrollable anyway. <laughs> we figured that out a whole long time ago. This is, a, this is a response to a deep yearning. It's really a response to those who are more frequently in our culture checking the nun box under religion, who have not found their home or are leaving what they feel to be exclusivist, rigid doctrinal teachings that, that restrict people or, or judge people. People who are leaving fear and guilt-based theologies and are seeking something more seeking a way to live effectively, seeking some heart and soul satisfaction in their lives. That's what this teaching responds to, and why I believe it to be growing and, and touching many, many more lives. So basically, we are a spiritual path of depth, love, and joy. We are a philosophy of wholeness, and we are a science of success.